Anne had a total of 285 red and blue beads. She used 45 red beads and 40% of the blue beads. So for part A, they won the fraction of blue beads that Anne used, which is over here. So for part A, it's just changing that 40% into fraction. So 40% is 40 out of 100, and I simplify it, divide by 20, divide by 20, I get 2 out of 5. And that's my answer for the first part, 2 fifth. So what does that 2 fifth means? 5 refers to the total units, 2 refers to the units that N used. So let's take a look at the second part of the question. After that, the ratio of the number of red beads to the number of blue beads became 1 to 3. What? How many beads did N have in the end? That's what they want to find out. That's in the end. But remember just now, we have already found out that at the beginning, there were 5 units of blue beads. And since N used 2 units, the remaining is 3, which is just nice. Which means the ratio before would be 1 is to 5. But do not forget about the 45 red beads that she had used. So we have a total of 6 units here, which is equal to 285. Subtract the 45 that has been used. So we will get 240 as 6 units. So now, the question wants how many beads did N have in the end, which is 1 plus 3 units, 4 units. So I'm going to find out this 4 units. But first, I have to find out what's 1 unit, which is 240 divided by 6 equals to 40. And then the last final step, which is 4 units, is 4 times 40 equals to 160. So the last question, part B, the answer is 160 beats.